Okay, continuing on, we have some more news courtesy of Supreme, and this is now considering their new shoes that are generally meant to be coming out soon, which I'm assuming is a Nike SP Blazer. This could be the ones that we saw recently, which were kind of um, a redo of the earlier models that they had before that I had, which were the quilted Blazer SBs. I had a sort of Gucci kind of um, print towards the back of the heel, which I generally end up selling. I had two pairs of the black and the red colorway, which I really regret selling them at the time, but it seems that they're going to be um, redoing them in a sort of updated model. I'm not sure if this is the actual model itself, but this is a video courtesy of Supreme, or courtesy of Supreme Drops that they obviously Supreme made, and it's called Brooklyn 2022. And hopefully, and, and this actually does feature the Supreme uh, Blazers that are meant to be coming out soon. They look pretty, pretty decent. And Blazers are not really the model that I'm always super fond of, but I feel like they're a model that if they're done in the right colorways, then they're definitely something that you could definitely, I could definitely see myself in. I think back to a particular model that I've always kind of had my eye on, which is the Poets Blazer SB. I'm not sure, sure if you guys remember that one. I think it was Gino in in Uacho, in Uichi, however you pronounce his name. Um blazer that he did back in the day but i remember that being one of my favorite blazers that i really liked where is it there we go was it was it poetry it was poetry yeah, that one was the navy one this blue one i thought this one always looked really lovely this came out a while ago and yeah it's poets lighthouse yeah this is really fucking lovely was it gino and you actually i think it's gino who does this brand i'm not too sure i forgot which one it is but anyway regardless it's like a navy upper with like perforated upper with suede with navy suede swoosh white laces with a white foxing and a navy navy midsole and outsole so pretty much navy all the way with some white in it you can't go wrong with that color combo is similar to like black and white it always works and that i thought was a really really hard and sick model um but yeah so i've always kind of had my eye on blazer sbs but again like i said they're not always the thing that really suits my shape of foot and so whatnot and my overall style but i thought these ones are really really tough and let's see what these uh blazer sb ones look like from this brooklyn videos so you can get a different vibe of them i might have to mute the music because i'm sure the music is going to be um something that's going to be legit that i'm probably not going to be able to get not copy strike on in here. Let's play anyway. S U P R E M E. Music of actually, let's look at the SBs themselves. The Blazers, you see regular skaters doing their tricks and hanging around doing their thing. He looks like it's got a bit of a design on the back of the heel there, if I'm not mistaken. I see a little design there, some sort of print. Let's go forward a little bit more. There's a guy wearing the Heavenly shirt. The Heavenly polo is flipping lovely in it from this season for winter coming up. It's really fucking nice, man. It's gonna, I think that's going to be a piece a lot of people are going to be end up buying and wearing a lot. I'm sure it's going to resell for crazy amounts too, but it's definitely, I've seen, I'll see a lot of people wearing that, I think, day to day, especially in festivals because it seems to be the quote-unquote attire of dudes when they go festivals, like a loud shirt and shorts and trainers and shit. It's crazy how many people you see wearing the same outfit, like vintage kind of fucked up shirts or Hawaiian shirts or something with, naruto or anime on it some jean shorts and some trainers it's like a standard festival attire so i think that'll do well but in general the blazers look pretty sick from what i can see here not real detail we can see too tough there's a black pair here that he's wearing they look like a complete all blacked out pair that i'm definitely going to be interested in because you know what i mean all black shoes let's fast forward this a little bit more got the guy wearing that pretty sick um jersey whatever that is with all the dates on it and stuff Maybe it's a day of the collab. Oh, oh yeah, that's in the four winner four in the sorry, twenty two collection too. I forgot. Um but yeah, not many details here. We've got a navy pair also that looks similar to the poets one with a white outsole. Again, you can see the swoosh there. It may look does it look like snake skin to you? It looks like it's been it's got some sort of pattern on the swoosh. It's like a white outsole, so a white midsole and white outsole. You've got a navy blue upper with like a brownish snakeish looking swoosh. So that may be similar to what i've seen beforehand continue on a bit more on this video here scrub a little bit more and you see another kid wearing a black pair with that kind of snaky print on the swoosh so they look pretty hard i'm not gonna be i'm not gonna lie so i'm assuming they're gonna have a navy they're gonna have a black pair with this with the with the snake swoosh they're gonna have an all black pair with the snaky print on it but it's gonna be black as well so maybe four or five colors i'm seeing already that are gonna be in the collection but yeah, Supreme always do really cool videos that give you a vibe of New York and America in general and what they're about and their crew and whatnot. You know what I mean? The feel, the tone of it is always really good. It's a guy, I forgot how you pronounce his surname, William something, that always 
producers and directs the videos and stuff they always seem to have a good handle on who the coolest hippest looking kids are to use in their videos also so that always helps as well but yeah these sbs look pretty decent pretty sick i can't really get a real good look at what they're gonna end up looking like but i'm eager to see what they do end up looking like when they finally do come out because like i said blazers are a really underrated model in general they don't really get as much love as they probably should do um oh yeah look they've got the little um see they've got the little uh ring the little d-ring at the back that i had on my um quilted sbs from back in the day so they might actually be quilted they don't look it from the picture or from this but they might be quilted actually so that's pretty sick i'm gonna actually screenshot that for later but that's pretty sick I, i'm not I, I i don't mind that to be honest i don't mind that so yeah let's look out for those when they do end up finally coming out let's look out for those 